Live Golf Chief Executive Greg Norman dismissed reports of a £627 million offer made to Rory McIlroy to switch from the PGA Tour. Norman insisted he has no insight into negotiations to reunite men's golf. John Rahm also spoke on whether Live should switch to 72 hole events. Greg Norman denied that Live Golf made an offer to Rory McIlroy to switch from the PGA Tour, but added the door remains open for anyone interested in joining the series. Four time major winner McIlroy, once one of Liv's staunchest critics but who has adopted a more conciliatory tone recently, was reported last week to have turned down a £627 million offer to switch allegiance. McIlroy was quick to shut down the rumours, insisting he had no ambitions to play anywhere other than the PGA Tour. Speaking ahead of this week's tournament in Adelaide, Liv Chief Executive Norman dismissed any notion an offer had been put forward to McIlroy, although the two-time Open champion would welcome talks with the 34-year-old or other players about what the Saudi-backed series could offer them. Liv never put an offer to him, Norman said. We didn't need to make a comment about this, this is just typical white noise that gets out there in the industry. If Rory was willing to sit down and have a conversation with us, would we be happy to sit down with him? 100%, no different than any other player who would be interested in coming on and playing with us. It's understanding the facts about what Liv represents and what Liv can deliver on a global basis, it's up to you to determine it. I've sat down with one top, top PGA Tour player in his house with another member of my team, walking through the whole process, and he was so impressed. He said, well, that's not what we're told in the locker room. This is really impressive, but he made the decision, he told me up two days later and said, I've decided to stay where I'm at. I said, happy days. You made a decision on fact. If you're happier over here, fine, stay there. Your door is always open, if you want to come back and have a conversation with us, happy to do that. Along with pledging his future to the PGA Tour ahead of last week's RBC Heritage, McIlroy's set to rejoin the PGA Tour policy board just five months after stepping down from it. The Northern Irishman's decision to take a place on the board as one of six player representatives, taking over from Webb Simpson, comes at a time when negotiations between the PGA Tour and Liv's financial backers Biff are understood to be stalling. Despite a framework agreement between the different factions in men's professional golf being announced 10 months ago, they have not yet signed off on a formal reunification. However, Norman insisted he had no insight into how negotiations are progressing and that his only focus is on continuing to grow live, which reaches the midway point of a 12-event 2024 schedule at the Grange in Adelaide this week. Dot.